Thanks. Well, the importance of education expected to be stressed in tomorrow night's State of the Union. But with Republicans giving the big thumbs down on the idea of any new stimulus spending, will the president say anything about the rising defaults on student loans? Following this story for us from Washington, also Peter Barnes. Hi, Peter. Well, hey, Lori. Student lending has skyrocketed as more people go back to school with unemployment so high out there, closing in on $700 billion in federal student loans, which is most of the student lending market. But experts say don't worry about it, and we probably won't hear much from the president about it tomorrow night. Despite the fact that with high unemployment and other challenges, loan defaults have jumped sharply, they are now about $58 billion in federal student loans in default, up from $33.5 billion four years ago. Official default rates have risen from about 5% five, five years ago to more than 7% now. This is the highest default rate we've seen in 11 years. Um, and there isn't any indication that it's going to be going down any time in the future. Now, according to the Chronicle of Higher Education, loan defaults for students who graduated in the mid-1990s, 20% to 40% now. But Mark Kantrowitz of the scholarship website FastWeb.org says, don't worry about it. First, government student loan contractors are very aggressive about chasing delinquent students. You can't get rid of a student loan uh, debt in, uh, in a bankruptcy proceeding, for example. And the government can and does garnish wages to get repaid, even garnishes Social Security benefits to get that money back for the taxpayers. Also, the government charges very high interest rates on student loans, about 7% right now, and it borrows money from the Treasury at very low rates, maybe 1% or 2%. And it charges fees on all these loans. So the government is making good money off of student loans, according to Kantrowitz, enough to cover net losses. Kantrowitz estimates the government actually makes a profit right now of about $5 billion a year on student lending. Lori? Well, thanks for unpacking that one for us. That's so interesting. Peter, thank you. I know a lot of colleges and universities <laughs> raising tuition as well, right? That's the other side of the yeah. story. Yeah. So I, I actually went back to school on this on all these numbers. It's pretty complicated. <laughs> Such a wild and crazy guy.